Hello, I'm Stuart Broadley, CEO of the EIC, which is the Energy Industries Council. We are the UK's largest energy supply chain trade association and I'm absolutely delighted to have organised this week's Energy Exports Conference here in Aberdeen. I'm equally delighted to welcome to this conference large delegation from Aramco and Sagia, who have brought along a lot of presentations about their very significant pipeline of project opportunities over the next 10 years, covering upstream, midstream, downstream, and of course, energy transition. And how important are events like the Energy Exports Conference for bringing together the key players in one room and starting discussions? I, I think these are critical because, you know, again, it's how do you become and maintain your relevance? How do you become diverse? And I think coming and looking at the supply chain and understanding what's happening in the supply chain, not only peer to peer, but from client to contractor, it's really important. We need to get collaborative and actually go out into the world collectively. This is a very important platform for users and suppliers to meet together to understand the needs, the demand and the supply for each organization. And talking together, having a, a, an event like this will provide the communication, the tools for both, you know, consumers and suppliers to understand and to connect together in this important conference. We're working with our supply chain companies. 80% of our membership is uh, made up of supply chain companies and working to make sure that they are resilient and that they are you know, strongly based in the UK so that they have a great base to export from. Um, we're also welcoming delegations from many other uh, countries so that our co uh, companies can see what is out there and where the opportunities lie. The Scottish Government is hugely focused on growing our economy in an inclusive way but also uh, increasing our exports because we understand that businesses that export more contribute much more to the economy and to society. And the energy sector in particular we see is hugely important to that effort. We produced our export growth plan, a trading nation, in May of this year and that really focuses down on how we use government and our agency and our resources to make sure that businesses export as much as possible. The conference has been absolutely fantastic. I mean, the first plenary session on day one, I think really set the tone for the conference so well. You know, what we're, what we're talking about here is things like the energy transition, uh, which is crucially important to all businesses, but also it's about taking products into new markets around the world. So you've got a lot of local companies here and they're also interacting with, you know, bigger global companies all over the world. So it's really emphasizing that there's a huge global market out there. It's been absolutely fantastic. It is an opportunity for all the all the businesses in the Northeast to get to speak to the right people and it's just absolutely great EIC have put this on. It provides a excellent opportunity to meet with lots of different UK companies and talk to them about possible opportunities that they may have to supply to Bechtel and Bechtel's projects globally. This is the second EIC show we've done um, and we find that they're very well organised, very good qualified attendees. They are very valuable, lots of added value, it's very good, yes. We found it uh, very busy uh, in terms of uh, overseas uh, visitors and fellow exhibitors uh, speaking to us about different uh, opportunities. We've had a lot of customers, people who we deal with globally, uh, coming onto the stand, interested in some of the things that we do, uh, going into new markets uh, and the interest that they have in extending the life of the assets. So it's been quite good for us, to be honest, yeah.